Wait a minute. Okay, we can't check. Around the corner that way. There's a door there. Wait, which door is that? That door leads to a one square room, squ uh, like square foot room. Okay, there's no zombies down this corridor. That's oh, because there's no corridor. It's just a blank wall, just a little alcove. Hello, guys, and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with me, Oxfu. And we're fighting zombies again. Thank God. I think I would go crazy if I had to fight another fish man. Okay. Well, I, I mean, I'm gonna have to fight another fish man, but I think I'd go crazy if I had to just fight another fish man right away. Alright, let's get out the knife. Stop wasting ammo on this fool. Yeah, this time we I decided that we're going for the second floor. Instead of just bumming around, running into fishmen, dying over and over again. Alright, so there are three rooms that we can enter. What's behind door number one? So I think I'm gonna do this one first because this is the only room that's not connected to another. Aha! Too smart for you, zombie. I had a feeling that one one of you would be there. Oh come on! You look like you're not about to fall, and I waste a bullet. Okay, Chris, show us your magic finger. You know, the one that pulls a trigger, not the other one. That's gross. <laughs> oh, he's not he's not dead. Oh, we're behind him, that's what matters. So, so he can't he can't bite our ankles off. Oh no, he's dead. Psh. Well, that's gonna be a mess that they have to clean up once they move back in, or, or well, once whoever buys this mansion moves in. Just a pile of zombies blocking up the elevator entrance. Disgusting what kind of filth these people lived in. <laughs> Alright. Pistol, get yourself ready. We are so screwed. We are so screwed. If only I had taken the shotgun with me. Okay. So nothing in here but shotgun shells. Oh wait, what's that? A battery. Now I can move the elevators in the courtyard. Mmm. Uh, well I take it now. Why the God damn it. God God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. That's twenty one shells. Could have had a twenty one gun salute for all of our comrades. <laughs> and we passed them up because we decided not to take a shotgun with us. How could I be so foolish? Actually, wait a minute. Oh. Let's hope that we're lucky, punk. And that there's no fishmen over here. Because if there's not... There's not. We might be able. We might be able to get to the shotgun that we have in storage. Maybe. Fingers crossed. Except not. You guys keep your fingers crossed. I can't because I'm playing the game and that would make things pretty awkward for me. Okay. We're down to, like, 25 bullets. I don't like this. But you know what? We've, we, we've, we've done it without bullets before. I don't like that sound. I don't know what that is. Oh, good. It's a feasting zombie. Oh, man. 
I never thought I would be so relieved to find a zombie feasting on the entrails of one of my comrades. Okay, run out. Run back. Looks like there's no zombies in these alcoves. Oh, because there's no room in these alcoves. Looks like we'd be able to see them right away if they were there. Except for this one. To the left, but there's no one there. Oh, zombies eating zombies. Makes you think. How twisted could this world get? Alright, I'm gonna knife this guy. Oh, God! That's... No, that's not cool, man. You can't have a zombie eating a zombie that's alive. That's... That's sick. That's gross. Oh, my God. I can't believe that. That... That just... That throws everything that I knew out the window. Step closer. Enough that you can hit him, not enough that he can hit you. Well, that didn't work. I can't believe how I'm more horrified than that than anything else we've seen in this mansion so far. Alright, I see his blood pooling, so he's dead. Alright, get one of those herbs. Yep, yep, yep. Might as well. Man, this this music as well. It's like, um... I don't know what it's like, actually. It reminds me of a television show, like... Oh, you know what? It probably reminds me... Reminds me of House. Oh, I've been... I hate that show because... <laughs> I can't help uh, watching it when the door. What? 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 I know the door's locked. What do you mean? Oh god. Do you mean we can't get out that way? Oh god. That's not good. Hmm. But I hate that show because I can't just get up and walk away from it when my brother or sister are watching it. And like, I, I really like Hugh Laurie and stuff, but I, I like him as a comedian. I don't really like him in drama as much. Oh no. That's fish people the other way. If I... If I die, then that's a, the same hour that I have to redo. What is this? What is this room? I am intrigued. Alright, let's try stabbing this guy in the back. Maybe there's pistol. Maybe there's gun food in here to take a line from Splitable Infinitive. <laughs> oh, come on. I didn't even get a chance to walk away. Not cool, man. But, um... <laughs> Desk is locked. If only we had a desk key, which we do. Let's go get it. Gun food, gun food, anybody gun food? That's what I'm hoping for here. It'd be a miracle. Yeah, we need to heal again, because we got another bite. Thank god these aren't regular zombies that would infect you with a bite, otherwise we'd be gone after like 10 minutes. <laughs> Do 
I'm really enjoying doing that. All right. <laughs> I love this too. The um, water is not supplied in a in a kitchen. The water is not supplied. Um. Yes, I'll take the small key. Thank you very much. We can fit more supplies now because we've run out of ammo. Oi. Just hoping something is up here. Because if not, we're so screwed. I don't have a good way to take on the fish people except the shotgun, and we left that. Of course, I can't believe that I forgot that we got shotgun shells on our way through the... The, uh, what's it called? The what's it? The, um, magnum rounds. No. I'm not gonna take magnum rounds, because they're useless to us. Right? Hopefully I'm not right. It has not been used for a long time, and it is dusty. What isn't? I mean, what is? What is dusty? It's not telling me what it is. <sighs> oh god! I saw that coming, but he wasn't pointing the gun. I saw that coming from like a mile away. Damn it. Chris. So dumb. Oh, there's a zombie coming down the hall. I guess I'd better just sit tight. It'll be fine. Totally fine. <sighs> Great. What are you doing, Chris? You're, the, you're the worst at walking in a straight line. There we go. Hopefully, he's dead. Probably not. No, he's not. No, 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 no. Jeez, these guys are taking a lot. Okay. There's the blood. Should use this to begin with. Oh, no, 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 no. Go back, Chris. You're equipping that again. Well, four bullets. What is this? Scrapbook. Raccoon Times, May 27th, 1998. Animal attack, woman mutilated, May 20th. Around 10 p.m., a 20-year-old young woman's body was found by a passerby on the left bank of Marble River in the Cider District of Raccoon City. Raccoon police assume it to be a grizzly or some other animal's doing because there are teeth marks along her mutilated arms and left foot that show considerable power. Since she was wearing a hiking boot on her remaining foot, it has been determined that she was attacked in the Arklay Mountains and fell into the river. They are hurrying to, to identify this woman. Raccoon Weekly, June 16th, 1998. Monsters in Arklay Mountains? Some people claim they've seen monsters in the Arklay Mountains. The monsters are supposedly about the same size as large dogs and usually run in a pack as wolves do. This may sound like a group of ordinary wild dogs, but these monsters are su surprisingly fierce and hard to hurt. They say these dogs won't bother you unless you wake them, so you smart readers should stay out of the Arklay Mountains for the time being. That's important. But if you're looking for adventure, check it out! You want to try? Oh my god. <laughs> way to, way to completely murder countless people looking for adventure. Mystery on Arclay Mountain, or July 9th, 1998. Mystery on Arclay Mountains, Mountain Road Block. Due to successive disasters in the Arclay Mountains, the city authorities have decided to block the road leading to the foothills. 
At the same time, Raccoon Police intend to begin the search for lost people with the help of STARS team members. They expect great difficulty because of the vast size of the Arclay Mountains and the prim uh, primeval forest that covers most of the area. Also, people are still reporting sightings of grotesque monsters in the mountains. <laughs> this has been Joe Waters with uh, News at 5. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. Something here. I can move it. I knew that. Let's move it this way. Nope, that was completely useless. Unless there's something below it. No. No, no, no. Of course not. Alright, let's go... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There might be enough of an edge that we can move it back. Yes, cool. No, do it, Chris. You just had it. No, you... J Damn it, Chris. Oh my god. Chris, you, you're terrible. You're a terrible, terrible STARS member. But that explains, well, why we're up here. Because <laughs> a stupid news reporter decided, Oh, guys! Weird animals, go up for adventure! Alright, let's push this again. And a hidden door appears. Hmm. I'm gonna go for the hidden door first. Next time on Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with Mio X Fu. See you guys then. Take it easy. Hello guys, and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with Mio X Fu with four bullets, a knife, and a key. And a hidden door. Let's see what behind awaits us, shall we?